Jason Hollis Outdoors today. Hadn't got Cody with me right now, but I do have something in and I just don't think I'm gonna be able to wait till we fool with it. So my buddies at the tire store hooked me up with some tires for the beast. What are these things? Swamper, Swamper Light. 2211 10s. I guess that's the brand name, Swamper Light. These things look pretty cool too, don't they? Got a little more traction to them than them others. I think they're gonna look good. I'm gonna grab, I gotta, got my impact. I gotta get me a battery off the charger and a socket. We're gonna stick these things on. I was looking at these things. They have these oh, plastic deals to cover the axle nut and all on the back and I was uh, I knew I had one I couldn't find the other but it's still in the wheel didn't even get lost getting put on so we in business I don't know if they're any taller or not we gotta see if they fit Steel. Oh yeah, money. Golly, that's gonna look good. I'm glad I went. They had one that had the same tread as as uh, what we had, but uh, I said let's go with that little more aggressiveness. just thinking about something there's a fella can't remember his name or I'd call him out just about every comment he ever makes about me kind of funny oh uh, about power washing I did the video me and Cody did the video on this and I talked about it I said man I need cleaned up I guess he didn't listen that had been sitting in the barn for seven eight ten years need to power washing you need to take care of your stuff well, he can kiss it because y'all know Jason ain't gonna do much power washing because it's gonna get right back in it. We use them. Oh, I gotta jack it some up just a little bit. I ain't doing no power washing until it's time to service or work on something. I'm just not doing it. I'm, I, I'm, I got too much to do to be power washing. That's all he says. You got to power wash. You ain't taking care of nothing. Well, I got stuff I've had forever. Just, he just needs to. I think I might block him next time. I may have already blocked him. I can't remember. Need about an inch. Half inch. Power washing. I call it pressure washing anyway. I don't call it power washing. 
I got one. It ain't gonna get wore out, I promise you. I do my ranger, you know, every time I get in service, that's about all it's gonna get. Looking pretty tough already, ain't it? Get this back on. Whoever that fella is, better look at these tires. This is probably the cleanest they ever gonna be. They sure ain't gonna get power washed, most likely. Unless they got a flat or something, they get some mud off of because it's tore up. That's gonna be about it. get these tires put on I got some new information that I learned about this and I'm gonna tell y'all it's pretty exciting I ain't gonna tell y'all all of it it's gotta be a little surprise but a little bit of the plan Can't be on just like I need to, but I just lay down and get it done. Oh, we'll put that on backwards. It's getting hot in here, too. Let's see 
what she looks like. Boy, that looks pretty sporty right there. I'm liking that tree. It looks good. They inside, pretty much inside the fender flares. I'll not get you muddy. I don't remember it ever getting you real muddy. I like that. I like that stance. A lot of people get taller and all that stuff. That's plenty. That is plenty. It's going to be perfect. All right, so when I put that video out the other day of me and Cody getting it down here and restoration, start part one, whatever, and taking the tires and wheels off next day, or it may have been that night, a buddy of mine down south texted me. He didn't know nothing I was doing, nothing like this. He said, you got to talk to me before you do anything with them batteries and continue on with the project. I said, okay, trust this guy, super guy. Anyway, I'm not going to let y'all in on everything. Uh, but I'm going to be, I'm probably not going to finish this project and I'll show y'all why and tell y'all why when we get it done. But this thing, when, uh, I'm, I'm feeling really good when we get done with this thing, this thing's going to be bad. So, um, next chance I get, I'm going to load it up on a trailer and I got to carry it north a little piece and, uh, we're gonna get some stuff done, and this thing gonna be maybe what you call, like you'd call an old Chevrolet pickup, long wheelbase. Uh, looks rough, and then you pull up beside it and he blows your doors off, a sleeper, maybe what you call it. We're gonna build us a sleeper, so. Anyway, uh, new tires, that's the main thing. We had to get it to where it rolled and quit having to air them up so we can do something. So anyway, oh. Uh, yeah, can't wait to the next one. It may be a little bit for the next one on this, but I'm not sure. It may not be too long, just depending on how it goes, but I will definitely bring it back to y'all. I'm excited. I like, I love the golf cars. I just had such bad experiences with them over time. And that's why I just kind of went back to the Rangers, dependability and stuff, but technology, you know, continues on. I hadn't fooled with it. I lot of love my bicycles. Hadn't had a lick of trouble out of them. And that's due to some of the technology, but, uh, I let it down south, I think, and, and yeah, I think he fixed it and uh, called this guy. He gave me his number, and yeah, things are fixing to get seriously quiet. And this is gonna be this is gonna be good. Uh, might give it one power washing for the guy watching, just because yeah, one time maybe. Probably I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna quit rambling. Uh, the next video ought to be good. I'll catch y'all on the next one.